the modern day asylum seeker is usually fleeing violence, persecution, and torture in their home countries. They might have suffered these harms because of a protected class. For example, they were of a different religion than the majority, or they, had, they held a different political opinion, or they were part of a particular social group, for example, homosexuals, who the government did not like and was trying to actively seek to destroy. Um, after fleeing their home country, they came to the United States, a lot of them seeking refugee status. And what happened during the Trump administration was that they banned asylum seekers from claiming protection in the United States if they did not first seek protection in a third country. For example, if someone traveled through Mexico and did not claim asylum there in Mexico, they could not come into the United States and claim asylum here in the U.S. Just this week, the U.S. District Court uh, in D.C. overruled that ban, saying that asylum seekers are able to claim protection here, notwithstanding having not sought protection in Mexico or a third country. This is just one small victory in the continued fight for asylum seekers' rights. As a reminder, asylum seekers, when they first come into this country, they must first pass a credible fear interview. This means uh, the uh, immigration officer must be satisfied that their claims to asylum is real, they're legitimate, and then they should be go going before an immigration judge. And the process of going before an immigration judge takes years because of a huge backlog in the system. And Trump has enacted a new law which extends the time for asylum seekers to be eligible for a work authorization document from 150 days to 365 days. This new law comes into effect in August of 2020. And notwithstanding any court challenges, it will pass and it will harm asylum seekers. My name is Ife He. I'm a lawyer fighting for your rights. I fight for asylum seekers. And if you have any questions about asylum law or international refugee law, give me a call. I am an international lawyer for your immigration problems. Thank you very much.